YouTube, what's up? How you guys doing? Today is the 13th of January. Yes, I know it's an unlucky day, but hey, um, I've got the one of the many Raps skins that Raps.com have sent me. Thank you very much again for sending me these skins. This one is for the MacBook 13 inch. They do have this version in pretty much every size from the Asus EEE PC to a MacBook 17 inch or a 15 inch Pro. Um, this is not the only size they've got. They've got various skins that they do. Check them out on raps.com. Alternatively, you can go on to play.com and if you put in raps, that's W R A P P Z in the search box, all their products will come up on play.com. Raps supply their products to play.com and they're a retailer. Anyways, not going to go into that, but yeah, pretty good, good website and I'm going to put this on, have it on for a few days and give you my feedback on this skin. So I'm just going to open it and um, apply it to my MacBook, which is currently connected to my monitor. Hence why it's got all the cables there. There we go. Just a few instructions at the back. It says no bulk, no extra bulk which is always handy, easy on, easy off, adhesive technology by 3M prevents bubbles and allows easy application and clean removal and the best thing is no scratches. So if you're not too keen on getting a plain invisible shield, a, you know, a see-through one and if you want some design this is one to go for. The good thing is, I think it's a good thing for apps having this feature here, pretty clear, easy in and easy off. Before I got this product, before Raps contacted me, I wasn't too sure because I thought, okay, if I'm going to do this as a review unit, how easy is it going to get to take off? If at all, it's going to come off. So they've really made it easier for everyone to actually, you know, read and understand that once you've got this on, it's not going to be. Mission Impossible to take it off. Very good. And it has... Sorry, just got a bit um, held up. Okay. Let's put this on. Let's see how easy it is to put this on. That looks amazing. <laughs> this is this guy has really good material. Trust me, this is absolutely quality material. It's a special paper, and you can actually smell it as well. So let's go ahead and put that on. In fact, this is going to go on on the one shot. This isn't going to be like the invisible shield where you're going to have to take it off and take it on. And the thing is, guys. You know the it's not going to be a perfect fit. It's actually just smaller. This is because the MacBooks are the 13.3 inch to be precise, whereas this is made for a 13 inch. So we have this applied. And if you take a look, you can see this is the MacBook silver lining running across. From here. So I suppose the only negative thing is this is made for a 13 inch, whereas the actual MacBook is a 13.3 inch. Um, but nevertheless, it's fitted on really fine, no bubbles, no problem putting it on. It literally took me, what, 20 seconds to put it on. Really good, no problems. And after three days, I'll do another video and I'll put it on after this and show you, give you my views on it. So see you then. What's up YouTube, welcome back to part 2 of this review. Now I've had this on for a few days now, precisely 4 days, and I must say it's a really good case. Um, what you might have realised was when I was putting this on, I put it on the wrong way. So I realised that a day after I had it on and it was really easy to take off. 
and turn it around and put it on the right way um, before the head was over here and it was just because when I was putting it on it was in a different angle and I didn't realise until you know I was walking about with it and I was like that doesn't seem right <laughs> um, but surprisingly it was really easy to take it off and put it back on it's amazing you know it's just fantastic bit of, you know, it's a really fantastic bit of kit it is made from special 3M film here it is here it's really easy to take off um, it doesn't damage any of the MacBook rest assured um, the only two downsides that I can think of this is number one is it doesn't cover the full MacBook and that is because this skin is made for a 13 inch laptop the MacBook is a 13.3 inch to be precise and that's why you've got your gap here the second thing and the most important thing is the actual Apple logo this skin covers that and what companies need to realise is that people who own Apple related products they care about the Apple logo, it's more of a symbol status I don't know if that's the right way to put it but there is one website or a one, one company that does deal especially um, for Mac users and they have a cutout for the Apple logo and I did get in touch with that company and I did place my order, a customised order for a skin um, you'll see when it comes, it was looking really nice when I was placing the order this skin, I like it because A, it's scratch proof B, because it's really easy to take off so now that the review is done I can easily you know, peel this off and there we go so I think you know if you it depends if you're looking for a Mac laptop uh, a Mac skin if you're not too bothered about the Apple logo getting covered then wraps is fine but if you are looking for that Apple logo I mean my laptop at the moment is it's on and you can't tell you know you can't even see the Apple logo shining which is bad in my opinion but again it depends if you know if you don't want the Apple logo to show up which I don't know many people that do want to, they'd rather show it they want the Apple logo to show there's no way of you know it'll be impossible to try and cut the Apple logo from this wrap skin it'll be near to impossible and even if you do you're gonna mess up in the process of cutting it out anyways that was my short review for the wrap skin I've got another three or four skins that I will be doing a review on and I'm just going to peel this off to show you how easy it is to take it off I'm just going to put this down just before I damage my monitor put this here and there we go that is it guys there's no messing about with you know taking it off, it's that easy, it's simple, there's no fluid, liquid, or you're not gonna mess about with anything as you are if you bought an invisible shield. Very easy to put on, it literally took me seconds to put it on, seconds to take it off, it does the job, very good. Um if I was to give it a rating, I would give it maybe a seven, seven and a half out of ten. And those two and a half, you know why. Thanks for watching. Feel free to join me on twitter.com slash theunits3 and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.